Hey friends, Lucian here with the Bullish Bears team. I wanted to make this video on how to download Think or Swim, the Think or Swim platform with TD Ameritrade. Uh, again, there's a lot of different brokers out there in the industry, and uh, we just like TD Ameritrade as an overall broker to use. They have a phenomenal trading platform that really gives you a lot of the charting services so you don't necessarily have to pay for another charting service monthly. Um, they give you really a great platform to use, interactive. It can be very complicated to use Thinkorswim at first. That's why it's when you when you get started you really want to give it the time uh, it deserves just by going through their platform, using it, really practicing with a paper trading or a virtual account first, which TD Ameritrade does offer on their Thinkorswim platform. Uh, they have a really great uh, virtual uh, trading account. And here's a tip for you, which they don't tell you this when you download their platform, but this is a tip to use that when you do open a TD Ameritrade account, when they give you a virtual trading account, they give you a simulated account where the um, charts are delayed. So when you go to use the service, it's a simulated account, but it's not real time. So here's the hint for you that when you do set up your TD, TD Ameritrade account, give them a call and say that you want real time data on your charts with Think or Swim. Because by default, they usually put it on a simulated with a delay to it. But uh, if you talk to their customer service and you do have an account with them, they'll make an exception and they'll give you live uh, charting data. And that's really important because if you want to practice with uh, using the Thinkorswim platform and just practice live trading, you want to use a you know virtual trading account for a few months until you get very comfortable making trades because a lot of people get into the industry and actually most traders that get involved and they want to start trading, they blow up their brokerage accounts because they're not comfortable trading. And the Thinkorswim platform, again, is very complicated and takes, some while, takes a while to get used to. So if you set up a TD Ameritrade account and you practice making a couple hundred trades over a few months with Thinkorswim and using their platform, it'll make you a lot more comfortable. Uh, it'll protect your brokerage account. And definitely you'll be thanking me much more down the road because if you don't, it's so easy <clears throat> to really get in and, you know, blow up your brokerage account. So, you know, that's my tip for you when you do set up a TD Ameritrade account. Uh, again, it's a little bit complicated, but once you are, um, you know, set up, then you want to come into the TD Ameritrade platform. So you want to log in to your individual account. So basically, you'll go to TD Ameritrade, you'll set up your account, you'll go through the process of filling out an application, um, you know, to get started with them. Once you have your individual account set up, then you want to uh, download the Thinkorswim platform. So again, where do you find it here? Well, there's so many different buttons and there's so, you know, again, it, it could be so hard to figure out how to use their platform and where to go. So I'm going to show you how simple it is. So once you're logged in to the platform, you're going to come back to your, uh, to, um, you know, the, whatever, the login screen here, you'll see your accounts and you'll see right here. Uh, I just have mine. I just relabeled mine for individual one, two, and three. Uh, actually, no three, but individual I labeled them as. But anyways, that's you'll see um, I have my information hidden right now, but you'll see your actual information, your account balances here when you log into TD Ameritrade. But what you want to do is you want to go and you want to log in and basically download the Think or Swim platform, which is going to go on your computer or on your desktop. So you'll be able to see it and log into that. That'll be the platform that you'll be using consistently. So what you do or what you want to do when you're logged in and you have your account set up with TD Ameritrade is you want to hover over the trade tab and then you want to come down over here to where it says think or swim and then you want to click on think or swim and I'm going to download it because I just got a brand new laptop here so uh, actually, I just got a couple recently, so I want to go down and I want to download it for this one. So uh, I will download it and talk to you for a couple more minutes here, see how long it takes to download. We'll see how quick. We'll do a test and see how quick this light, this laptop is. It's a new HP here, so we'll see. So basically, you went over to Trade. You hovered over it. You came down to Think or Swim. Once you clicked on that, it'll say Download Think or Swim. So let me click on it. See how long this takes. It's pretty big. 
eh, about 74 meg down here. So it says about six minutes left. So that's how simple it is to actually download Thinkorswim. Again, it could be very confusing how to find it. There's so many things when you go in, all these different tabs. And as you can see, there, it, you could get lost in the information. But with just, you know, just taking a look why that's downloading here, just some of the other things. There's a whole research center where you can learn so much about, you know, mutual funds and stocks and you know all different forms of trading there's a whole resource center in here where you could really get lost in here but it's really good information though too so if you want to go in you know going over here let's say to education you can see all the different talk or uh, topics such as like stocks and bonds and options if you want to look and uh, research and go over their videos um, they really have some great training information to go over so I highly suggest you know taking some time when you're getting started because it's so easy to want to just hop in and start trading and making money right away but that's an easy way to blow up your brokerage account and that's how many people do it so to get really familiar with TD Ameritrade and or any broker you want to get in practice paper trading for a while or virtual trading it's kind of weird saying paper trading when it's using a virtual account, but you know, people are just used to saying paper trading. So open a virtual account, practice making trades, getting comfortable with the platform. Again, the Thinkorswim platform is very complicated. Um, when you first get started, you can see down here, it's taken a little bit of time here to download. I don't know if you can see on your end, but on my end, it's showing another 42 minutes. So it's a big 74 megs. It's a pretty big platform, but I am on wireless. But yeah, that's how you download the platform. Again, get yourself familiar with it. Another tip, I just can't, you know, the same tip again from the beginning. I just can't stress it enough is that once you get the platform um, downloaded, you want to make sure when you're in your paper trading account, look up to the top left. Um, you'll see it uh, when you, it, you can't see on this video here, but you'll see when you log into your platform uh, where it says paper trading, it'll say simulated trading. Um, if it says delayed at all, all you got to do is just call up Thinkers or TD Ameritrade and just say that you want the real time data added. They'll add it on for you and uh, you'll be good to go. 